Hey, what's up guys? It's Viatac, and here's some Hunter x Hunter news on the manga series, of all things, of course. And we have some, not really confirmation, but we have some news that has basically been showing signs of life for Hunter x Hunter, and also a possible confirmation that we will be getting the manga series in 2016. There was an article a few months ago that I was actually going to cover, but it wasn't exactly substantial, and that was that in, in Japan, in Togashi's hometown, there was a festival, and he had a art display that had some new artwork that he did, and it, some of it was Hunter x Hunter related, so it showed light, uh, you know, Togashi's actually working on some things, and he, because beforehand he just had the back problems and he wasn't actually working on anything so it at least showed that Togashi's working on a little bit Hunter Hunter related but the big thing is in the 30th anniversary art book I believe of Dragon Ball Z where a bunch of shonen creators such as the One Punch Man guy you know obviously Akira Toriyama then Taite Kubo, Ichiro Oda, a bunch of other people including Togashi, did the, their own art in this book. And in the back of the book, it said that week, that Hunter x Hunter running in Weekly Shonen Jump in 2016. And so that basically means that Hunter x Hunter is slated for 2016. I don't, because before it was on hiatus, and now it is supposedly slated for 2016. There was also, you know, with the art going around, there are just like rumors that... Uh, Togashi is right now trying to amount a comeback for 2016. It makes a ton of sense because of the fact that the series really is at a point where it's just going to go into a huge arc, potentially like amazing arc with the Dark Continent. You know, it left off on a very big cliffhanger because we only got like a few chapters when he came back from his other hiatus, and those chapters were amazing, like fucking amazing. Like there's so much text that I could actually you know read on and uh, analyze, and there's not a lot of mangas I can actually do that with. But Togashi always puts in, puts in so much details and that's why I really miss the manga. It's one of the best manga series out there, to be honest. And that's why I'm really glad that we have this news that it is going to be running in 2016. So I'm assuming Togashi is amounting a comeback in 2016. And, that, and that's what he's going to try to do. And so we should be looking forward to something happening in 2016. Because, you know, we will be having Bleach probably end this year. And... They're going to need to pick up another big name, I feel like, in Shonen Jump, and Hunter x Hunter is, like, a good... That is definitely a very good replacement. I mean, I don't think Bleach is going to end until probably, year, like, 2017, but still, like, Shonen Jump needs more big names, and Hunter x Hunter was one of their big names. It's even come to the point where bookstores have started collecting up volumes of Hunter x Hunter and start selling them in bulk because they think the series is over. You know, Togashi has, of course, had those back problems, but... It looks like he's out, he's working on Hunter x Hunter, and it is slated for 2016, so let's just hope we get an official confirmation from Shonen Jump, but this is as official and substantial as we can get right now on Hunter x Hunter. We have had nothing, just a dry spell for a year of Togashi, and this is something that we can grab onto and have hope that Hunter x Hunter is going to be in 2016, because it is slated for 2016 Weekly Shonen Jump. So... I'm going to leave the links in the description. You guys can make up what you will with this, but I'm just going to leave this up in the air and just hope to hell that Hunter x Hunter is coming back because it is one of the best manga and anime series. Like, 2011 anime is so good. That's how I started actually watching the series in the first place. And, of course, I would be reviewing the series, you know, whenever it came out. I mean, I don't think that he will be doing it weekly. He will... I mean, he probably will be as a shonen, but... If I could have it, I would honestly have it come out monthly or bi-weekly. I feel like Togashi could do it much better that way because he just gets stressed out, obviously, over the week-to-week -week basis. And, you know, a bunch of different mangakas have, you know, explained the, <laughs> the the pain that goes into making these weekly manga series like Ichiro, the not sleeping and stuff like that. So, let's just hope it's coming back in 2016, as the back of this art book says. And I will be seeing you guys later for more manga reviews and discussions, of course, you know, I will be having the Bleach up next week and then Attack on Titan when it comes out. And of course, if you guys 
want me to review other series please leave a comment below and of course the comment of the day is what do you when do you think hunter hunter is going to be coming back what i mean what does hunter hunter mean to you because it is one of my favorite series you know my favorite part of course was in the chimera arc, arc you know just like all the battles in there with netro versus Meru, you know going versus um Ahsoka was one of my favorite parts of the series also that wasn't the chimera arc but there was just so many pivotal scenes in that show that it just was like whoa like this is really good manga and anime so if you've never seen it, i'd really recommend watching it before it comes back or reading the manga of course so we'll be seeing you guys later please consider giving it a like or a dislike depending on how you like the video and if you really want to support the channel please consider subscribing and i will be talking to you guys later thank you for watching and have a good day Thanks for watching my video. If you would like to check out more, there's of course on my channel much more reviews, discussions of other anime and manga series, and there will be an annotation over here for my latest video. And if you would like to support my channel, please leave a rating, a like or a dislike, however you liked it. And if you would really like to support me, consider subscribing or clicking an ad because that goes towards funds to get new equipment because I do want to, you know, the ad revenue that I'm getting from this channel, albeit very small, is going to go for a new camera and editing equipment and for things only for the channel. So if you would really like to support the channel, please click an ad. But I will be seeing you guys next time.